because I had a question about when she posted our room was beautiful. So I asked her when she says our, are y'all a thing now? Like it hit different. You know you famous for going to jail? Let's start there. I'm like, I'm famous for being pretty in jail. Jealous of prison mate? You sound like him. How am I be jealous of somebody that stabbed somebody in the neck? <laughs> I don't trust him. Oh, I've never once said she was ugly. I'm not a hater. I don't know why y'all want me to be a hater. She's not an ugly girl. Like before he was able to tell her story, like how I always tell him, you had this lady bending down on her knees and bent over. I don't even play those games. Jay made like skinny. It's a beautiful flash cone, and as the seismographs predicted, it is a result of light and shadow. But yeah, like the big booty women be for entertainment purposes. That man likes skinny women. The ash here is washed downstream, where it fills the lower slopes of the volcano. You have to look at any of his ex girlfriends. But she's only had, what, maybe three, four serious relationships his whole life. And then oh all the people who he whooped with. <laughs> whoop is not a J-Main word. Whoop is a J-Main word because Yahweh has his fan out. Let me keep playing. I'm going to step in. I am cranked up. Stop mentioning that guy. Like, that's the part of the reason why I don't talk to nobody as is. Mentioning him is crazy. Like, how far you think that we gonna get if you fans of him or just ew? Like, no. <laughs> we don't live together anymore because he's a slut, and I'm not with it. I'm tired. Tell out, let let his ass tell it. I'm washed up was the real words that my fuckers told me. <laughs> I'm about to be 30 next year. I'm washed up. And like I told him before, I, I just don't care for him to say anything about me on the internet. Because he don't never have shit nice to say. Like for, for us to have been in a relationship for eight years, you don't never have shit nice to say. And that blows me. I'd be like, damn, you'd have thought that. Like, you could talk about the billboard that I bought your ass for life, for forever. Like, I paid for that bitch to be up there for a whole week. In front of the United Center with his album on it. It'd be like, um, Telly moved us to Vegas. Say that. <laughs> Like, uh, Telly helped me start getting paid from YouTube, Instagram, TuneCore, Google Assets. It's a lot of shit that a motherfucker could say that's real fucking nice. But it's a lot of bullshit that I could say that it was like, it'd just be crazy. It'd be crazy what people choose to say for attention. And that's, yeah, I heard him when he said that too, that I can't handle the clout. And that's why, when he said that was why I posted the picture of hella bands with Black China. Because when you say Telly can't handle the clout, knowing that my first baby daddy had Black China, Manju Bia just blew up. If you go on her page, she was dating him. You didn't see me had no issues with none of these people. These people are rich, have way more money than me. Jealous or can't handle clout is crazy. No, it's more so one of the things where it's like, ain't necessarily like, oh, you got money and switched up, but more so, you think I'm supposed to stand for anything. And it's like, no, I have morals. I have respect. Your ass is going to respect me in my face because the shit that he doing... The things that he have going on, his ass will never 
do no shit like that in my face unless it's a camera rolling and he knows he's going to get attention off of it. Other than that, don't play them games. Just let him whoop, hold her down. This is first time with real fame and money. I don't give two dams. <laughs> I would give two fucks. I mean, it's a lot of people with they first time doing a lot of shit. It's about respect. To me, regardless of how you make your money, what you gonna do to it, respect is everything. It's about the things that y'all don't see. It's, uh, um, like I'm from Chicago, right? The whole thing of holding the nigga down. Baby, what I look like holding, hurting the palms of my hands to hold another grown ass motherfucker down? Is y'all slow? Like, you pick and choose, but holding somebody down? Okay. It's a difference between support when you're in a relationship. But y'all don't understand. In my own everything, he's been blocked. Like, even when I added him back, all his shit is muted. Y'all repost this shit enough, I see it. I think he's fucking V. That is that man's business. I feel like if y'all talk, it'll make things so much better. He's a liar. That's really our biggest disconnect. He lies so much.